My dear, I know there is a misunderstanding between us, a deep, unspoken one. You think you know me, that you understand who I am and why I make the choices I do. But the truth is, the person you think I am is a version of me that doesn't exist. It's not your fault entirely. Maybe I played along, letting you believe in a honest version of me. Maybe I thought it would be easier that way, less messy, less disappointing. But the reality of who I am is far from the image you carry in your heart. And the truth, the truth is brutal. Like this video and type triple one if you believe in your love. My dear, I'm not the person you assume me to be. I wish I could tell you I'm perfect, that I always make the right choices, that I'm the person you hope I am, but I'm not. I'm a deeply flawed soul, stumbling my way through the chaos of life. And I don't always get it right. In fact, there are times when I've gotten it so wrong that I've been ashamed to even face myself. I've made mistakes, big ones and small ones, mistakes that have left scars on me and perhaps on others too. If I could keep this part of me hidden, I might have. But pretending doesn't help anyone, not me, not you. The polished version of me you hold on to isn't real. What's real is messy, imperfect, and complicated. And I can't live in the set of that polished person anymore. Like this video and subscribe to banish the negativity. My dear, here's the raw truth. Taken wrong turns and at times knowingly made choices that weren't right. Regret clings to me like a second skin, a constant reminder of all the times I could have done better but didn't. It's not easy to admit this, even to myself. But I've carried this weight for so long and it's time to let it out. It's time to stop pretending, stop hiding and start facing the truth of who I really am. You see, there's a side of me that feels like it's been drowning in silence. A side that's been screaming for someone, anyone, to understand the chaos I carry inside. There are days when the weight of it all feels unbearable. When the same I regret feel like they'll swallow me whole. I'm not the pillar of strength you might think I am. I'm not the unsinkable person you imagined. I'm fragile. I'm vulnerable and most of all, I'm human. There are days when I feel lost like I'm wandering through a fog with no clear path in sight. I wonder if I'll ever find my way, if I'll ever truly feel at peace with myself. And yet, even in the darkest moments, there's a tiny spark inside me that refuses to go out. 
It's the part of me that still hopes, still believes, still wants to be better, not for anyone else, but for me. I want to look in the mirror and feel proud of who I am. But the journey to that place is slow and it's not a straight line. I stumble, I fall, I get back up, only to fall again. It's exhausting, but it's also necessary. Like this video and type triple three to heal yourself. My dear, I know I've disappointed you. I know that the truth of who I am might not match the image you've held on to. And that hurts because I never wanted to let you down. But I can't keep pretending to be someone I'm not. It's not fair to you and it's not fair to me. I have to stand in my truth no matter how painful or messy it might be. Because in facing the truth, there's also a chance for growth. A chance to heal, a chance to become someone better. There's something strangely liberating about admitting all of this. It's like a weight has been lifted off my chest, even as I stand here, exposed and vulnerable. For so long, I've been afraid to show the real me, afraid that my flaws and mistakes would make me unworthy of love or understanding. But maybe, just maybe, there's strength in vulnerability. Maybe there's beauty in being raw and real. I'm not perfect, I never will be, but I'm trying. I'm trying to learn from my mistakes, to grow from the pain, to find meaning in the mess. I'm trying to be honest with myself and with you, even when it's hard. Because I believe that honesty is the first step toward redemption, toward becoming the person I want to be. Like this video and type triple nine to attract love. My dear, I don't know where this journey will take me or how long it will take to get there. But I do know this, I'm not giving up. I'm not letting the weight of my flaws and regrets define me. I'm choosing to move forward, even if it's one small step at a time. And I hope that, in time, you'll see the real me, the messy, flawed, but determined soul that's still standing, still hoping, still trying. So here I am, bearing it all. This is who I am, not the perfect person you imagined, but the real person, flaws, mistakes, regrets, and all. And while it's not easy to face this truth, it's also freeing. Because in embracing who I truly am, I'm finding the courage to become someone better. Someone stronger, someone who's not afraid to live in the light of the truth. And that, I think, is a step worth taking. Like this video and type triple five if you believe in your love. Prayer, divine financial guidance, repeat after me. Dear Lord, I seek your grace today. Guide me in all I do and say. Help me live up to my family's call to rise above and stand tall. In matters of finance, show me the way, with wisdom and balance, 
Let me sway. Lord, let love bloom in my life, away from worries and unnecessary strife. May I honor my family and friends, and in my heart, let love never end. Through sharing moments with those I hold dear, may the bonds grow strong year after year. Lord, let my earnings grow with ease, and in your hands, may I find peace. May I safeguard my heart and mind, and always seek your will to find. Help me rise above all fears, and trust your plan despite the errors. In your strength, I stand tall today, not bound by trends or worldly sway. For in being me, I find my light, and with you, Lord, my future is bright. Grant me the courage to take the lead, and with your love, my heart shall succeed. Like this video and type Amen to claim this prayer.